friend Sean Janelli, who sometimes goes by Illinois John Fever, will be out here to uh, entertain you with some of the wild things that he does. He's been uh, considerably wilder than I am. Uh, and then uh, there will be a brief intermission during which I would be happy to meet you out in the lobby and sell you t shirts or CDs and anything else you might like to buy that we have available for sale, of course. Um, and then uh, Dave Moore, who some of you may be familiar with, will come out and entertain you for the second half of the program. Now, uh, I mentioned that it's been kind of a weird week. The fact that it's been kind of a weird week involves that Darren Matthews, who is uh, the guitar player of Thankful Dirt, got called for jury duty. Now, if any of you know, anybody know who Darren Matthews is already? That one person knows that if they were the person who was selecting for jury, I'd be like, who's that guy? Get him out of here. Darren Matthews is, a, is a, he's a criminal. I played in a band with Darren Matthews for a good long time. It's true. I played in a band with Darren Matthews for a good long time. He is one of the kinds of people who will, uh, uh, he drinks beer in the daytime and smokes a cigarette when he wakes up in the morning and all that stuff. Some regular people do, and some criminals do. And uh, the first and last verse of this song was, in fact, inspired by an experience that I had while sitting next to Darren Matthews uh, on the uh, New Year's Eve afternoon. He showed up a day early for a New Year's Eve show because there was supposed to be an ice storm. This was several years ago. He was living in Des Moines, and I was living in Iowa City. Well, he came and we went out the night before and it took us a long time to get out of bed the next day. And we went directly down to the bar where I read the paper and drank coffee and he started drinking beer right away. And he got kind of bored with me about partway through the day and he said, look man, I'm gonna go outside and smoke a cigarette. And you're boring me to tears if there aren't shots on the bar when I come back in here. I don't know what I'm gonna do. <laughs> so I ordered some shots of whiskey. Tennessee whiskey. And uh, he came back in. And he said, What's that? I said, It's whiskey. He said, My wife doesn't let me drink whiskey. So, uh, Jesus Christ. There were about four other people in the bar. It was one of those bars that goes like this. And the front window of the bar was behind me. And uh, well, I'm like, All right. And I had ordered a beer too because I didn't want him to be completely bored for the rest of the day. He may have been more entertained as I became slightly intoxicated. It was going to be New Year's Eve, so uh, I drank that shot of whiskey. And it had been storming all day because it was supposed to be an ice storm. And, so, and I turned around after I drank the shot of whiskey. I was like, oh. And I turned around, and the sun came out just for a second. And I turned back around to everybody else who was sitting at the bar, everyone else was hunkered over their drinks. And I said, did you guys see that? And they said, see what? I'm like, well, I drank that shot of whiskey, and the sun came out just for a second. And it, in that moment, everyone who uh, had been judging for their behavior over the course of the day looked back at me like I was crazy. <laughs> I drank whiskey and sun came early. No, you were crazy. So, uh, you know, we sat there for the rest of the afternoon uh, waiting for time for us to go load in at the place where we were going to play our New Year's Eve gig. And uh, it got to be about 5 o'clock, which is when we needed to be there. It would have been a shame that whiskey to sit on the bar and go to waste. So right before we walked out the door, I drank the other shot and the sun came out and it stayed out for the rest of the afternoon. <laughs> so the first and last verses of this song are, uh, the sun don't just shine, or the chorus of the first and last verses, are, the sun don't just shine when I drink my whiskey, it shines when I drink yours too. And it's a story about a thief and it doesn't have anything to do with the story that I just told you. But now you know where it came from. And hopefully that will help you engage yourselves with the story there is in it in some way. Anyway, there you go, son. I didn't break a camp and ride this road so I could stay home on the feet. I've been laying down on the highway man's wife, so that's what I do. And the sun doesn't just shine when I drink my whiskey. It shines when I drink your glass too. So stand and deliver, do what I tell you to do. I said the sun would just shine when I drank my whiskey. It shines when I drank yours too. So stand.
stand and deliver do what I tell you to do. I took my mother's door barber and she turned me away at the door. She said a man who makes his money like you don't need to come around here anymore. Me and them Howard boys could that goose and tell stories about the war. See, sometimes you're rich, sometimes you're poor. I said that me and the Mama boys could that goose and tell stories about the war. Mm -hmm. Sometimes you're rich, sometimes you're poor. And a man who lives by a truth's heart, keeping no family at all. Except for maybe one that's brave enough to leap by the side of the road when the wild birds call. And whimsy is the muse of the brave heart and tribulation is all. All for one and one for all. I said the whimsy is the muse of the brave of heart and tribulation is all. All for one and one for all. But she makes it easy for me to steal your mind from you. She makes it easy for me to do what I might do. I didn't break from camp and ride this road so I could steal your money from me. I've been laying down with a highwayman's wife, so that's what I do. And the sun loves to shine when I drink my whiskey, it shines when I drink yours. I said the sun don't just shine when I drink my whiskey. It shines when I drink yours too. So stand and deliver, do what I tell you to do. Stand and deliver, do what I tell you to do. I'd like to thank you guys very kindly. Sean Miller is getting ready.